Hey guys, welcome back again. I am MJ and today I am going to show you how to configure or set up in-text Wi-Fi router in your desktop or laptop. So I will show you the first ports and other things in the Wi-Fi router. So this is a WAN port, connect your internet cable here and this is a LAN port, connect your LAN here and one end to your desktop or laptop. So after this, just go to your network and take on properties. And click on change adopter setting here okay click on change adopter setting and select the local area connection and click on property and here select the internet protocol version and click on property so here very important thing you have to know this so check on obtain an IP address automatically and check on obtain DNS server address automatically so check on this two things this one this one and click ok ok that's it and now come to the browser which your browser you are using internet explorer mozilla or chrome i am using chrome right now so open the browser and in the browser just type 192.168.0.1 this is a default ip address of index router index wi-fi router so just enter this and hit enter okay so this is a user login page of uh, router and type your password the default password is admin so type admin and click login okay this is a login and go to advanced setting here you can see the advanced setting click on advanced setting in advanced setting click on your WAN setting here you can see the WAN okay so here you can see the mode option the PPPOE and static IP and DHC and like this so this is the important thing you need to ask this to your internet service provider which type of service they have and they will provide you all these things like IP address sub subnet marks and gateway DNS server and alternate DNS server all these things they will provide you and you have to just enter the IP address here and right now I have the static IP address type of my internet connection as you can so I have take the internet static IP so you you just you need to ask this type of which type of connection they have internet providers so ask them and take all details and after this just select your uh, internet type like a static IP and just here in the IP address fill the IP address like 10.10.1122 .10 or 25 255.255.0. This is my IP, my IP address, so I have set here. So just enter the you are all this thing like IP address, sub, sub minute marks and gateway, DNS server, alternate DNS server. So just all this thing, fill this all this thing properly and don't be mistake here because it will depend on all your IP address. So after you fill carefully, just click on OK. OK, so it's now you can see here it's connected. So this is the WAN setting and now you need to go to and do the setting of wireless. So here you can see on the top side wireless setting. Click on this and here the wireless basic setting. This is the keep, just keep it default, don't disturb this. And here you can change your Wi-Fi name so I have just kept the home because I am right now in the home so using home Wi-Fi so I have took in the home and in the broad squad just enable to check on enable and AP isolation just disable so do the setting I will zoom in look at us okay and this is the auto select and the WMM capable enable and APSD capable disable so do this setting don't disturb this setting okay so just click okay and the other thing is security password of your Wi-Fi. So just click on wireless security. So here again showing your name of your Wi-Fi. And here you have to set this security mode. So keep it default. Look at that. Keep this one. The mix WPA or WPA2. Okay. So here V WPA logarithms. So take the TKPA, this one and the key is you need to enter the password here like your wi-fi password i have just given one two three four five six seven eight so this is my password 
of Wi-Fi so you can uh, change or give any password of your Wi-Fi so after you keep do the, all this thing just click OK so done everything is set up this is the basic setting I have showed you don't need to know the all these things in the show in the all router setting so this is a basic uh, van setting and wireless setting that's it and after this here you can see the system tool just click on this and click on Rebo reboot the router so reboot your router one time and after you would complete just close all the tabs and it's better to restart your computer and after this just go to your try to open page okay so it's open now it's configured fully like WAN and Wi-Fi and first time it will ask to log in your internet service customer ID and password if you are using any local internet service provider like they, they will give the their customer ID and password so enter your customer ID and password and enjoy the internet setting in Intax so this is the basic setting I have showed for Intax Wi-Fi router so thank for watching and if you have any question or doubts or if you got any confusion in my pronunciation so you can ask me in comments thank, thank you for watching and please don't forget to like comment and subscribe thank you very much thank you for watching please like share and subscribe